This goat is just not in a place that makes me... Whatever, we're just going to have to kill it the old... Fa oh, look! Thanks for running into a corner, goats. You sure are good at dying. It's no wonder that I'm at the top of the... I'm the king of the jungle. And... You're just like... A piece of poop on my shoe at best. Why does one of these hyenas have to be sleep? Oh, now they're both sleeping. Alright. And then we'll get this other one. Yeah! Uh oh, uh oh, now they're gonna go toxic though. Look at how toxic it is outside. I like how I say go toxic because that is not a phrase in real life. Like, any normal person would say they're gonna go bad because food goes bad. You don't like, be like, has this milk gone toxic? Milk has gone toxic. Oh man, now I'm gonna start referencing uh, John Malkovich's gaming game show, which, by the way, that's, that's a JonTron video. If you are into that sort of humor, which I am, go look up John Malkovich's gaming game show. It's pretty fucking hilarious. And he also has John Malkovich's Guilty Gaming Pleasures, which is also pretty awesome. Oh, it's not desperate. I'll take it. It's going to take me like 2,200 more calories, or how many more calories is it going to take me to... Yeah, it's going to take me like 2,000 more calories just to get more stuff. So I'd rather... See, in this way I can level down be a cub then I can get the stuff in cub mode the challenge stuff I'm like not using like I'm using the vague the vaguest nouns ever I almost like literally on accident said vagist okay did I hear okay so I need to get one more challenge done I've not been rocking those clean kills have I <laughs> oh no I only need one more Okay, okay. Whatever is over here, it's about to get clean killed. That's all I gotta say. Alright, dear. You're gonna be the straw that makes the camel stronger. That's not a phrase. Alright. And now we have to defeat the Dinon the Dinonicus boss of Yamanote Line West. Something gives me the feeling that this quest is going to be a total bitch. So where should I head? to get my health kind of up. Maybe, okay, here's what I'll, hmm, here's what I'll do. We're going to clip through the sewers where hopefully there will be a reasonable amount of food and there I can grow up and get some more, get another challenge done and then mate again, hopefully get a prime mate maybe in Yamanote. I'm like planning for areas that, wait, okay. Because obviously I can't grow up in the sewers because, um, I don't think I'd be able to get out, right? I'm try kind of trying to think, okay, let's see how much food the sewers has. Oh, the sewers has plenty of food. All right, sewers, this is the way. I think this is actually the way that I want to, uh, to go. Oh, yeah, look at this. We're already in food central here. Here in the sewers... We're in a little town I like to call... Oh, we're in a little town I like to call Food Town, except for... Is that on the top tier? Is that... Oh, can I... Alright. Oh, except for the boars. Okay, this could get dicey, but I'm doing it anyway. We'll get this clean kill. Oh, except for there's boars up top, too. Uh-oh. Dude. Oh, this is so dicey what I'm doing right now. And I'm, like, stealth eating in the grass. Okay, we're gonna get this boar, too, now. Oh, and I failed in take 4,500 calories. All right. Wait, oh. The boar is just barely in the grass, so it won't let me stealth kill it. And it's alerted right now. I think that's the other problem. All right. Oh, dude. These boars, if they get one of their charges off on me, I am so effed. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, man. That was pretty damaging. Okay, here we go. There we go. There's another boar. Get some stealth eating. And that other one went down below. Dude, this was actually a really good idea because now I'm, like, ranking up. And these boars are just so caloric. All right. We'll... St oh, it just got... It saw me. Whatever. Haha. -ha. Dude, strategy worked. I almost lost a cub, but... That strategy did not not work. That strategy didn't not work. So, 
And check it out, I'm gonna be veteran so fast. By the time I emerge from the sewers, I am gonna rank with a prime female. Dude. I am like, proud of my sweet strategizing skills. Hopefully there's no vicious animals sleeping. Nope, it's just, uh... It's just, oh, why do you have to wake up right now? Stupid shit. Oh, fuck. Fucking shit-ass little chimpanzee. Thinks he's so hot because he can wake up. I can wake up too. In fact, I'm already awake and I'm killing you. That's... I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm already awake and you're dead. Alright, dude. I should have snuck up on these porcupines. Luckily when, um... They're not like... Standing still and defending, they're easy to take down. Now what I really have to worry about is if, by perchance... Oh, no, damn it. Dude, see this is the bad part about being the lion cub. It's weak as fuck, but... If I hit veteran, I will be happy. See, there we go. I feel like my strategy is already paying off. Now, I will be a little bit worried about my strategy if it turns out, yep. That's actually what I was worried about. Let's try and sneak past these. I was like, I will be a little bit worried about my strategy if whatever this pack of animals out here... What are my lion family doing? Look at this, they're like glitched. They keep on... Every time they spawn back in, they run back to... Um, that to fight those like Lyceons over there. I'm like, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. We we'll just get some Sam Jerky. And don't do anything stupid, Lion Pack family. Oh no. Luckily, oh no. And these are Lyceons. Oh crap. Oh crap. Dude, I might be. If I keep running right now, I'm gonna be in one of those like infinite loops that you've seen me get into where I just get like a million animals on me. Because I bet like the rest of these sewers from this point on are going to be, like, infested with Lyceon. Oh, nope, I'm lucky. It's just a bunch of porcupine. And we're gonna have to kill this. There's no way I can do this without taking your life, wolf. I have to kill you to live. That worked out better than expected. Like, in all honesty, <laughs> that went way better than I expected it to go. I thought I was about to get, like, a pack of... 80 Lyceon on me. I mean, you've seen it before in my videos, what happens when I start, like, getting into running mode. Or I'm just like, I gotta run from everything and basically die. Be a good present. Eh, bottled water, that's not bad. If I'm having trouble finding food, it'll get me through the day. Oh, and a mushroom. If I were a plant eater right now, that sure would be cool. Alright, what do we got? Okay, you know what? Not even... Okay, we gotta do the trick to... There we go. Do you see that? It's not even, dude, it's not even worth going for that animal. I've got plenty of bottled water to get me through the day. I'm not taking any risks until I can get to, um, until I can get to a place where I can mate. And now, of course, I can be a, I can get a prime mate now because I was smart. Because I stayed a lion cub and got all my calories easy mode instead of hard mode. All right, cool. All right, we got a zebra over there. Don't want to fuck with the zebra. Actually, I'm hungry. Well, look at all this bottled water. Doesn't matter. Look at how much freaking flea shampoo I'm picking up. I haven't slept with any dirty, desperate mates yet. I don't need the flea shampoo. Plus, of course, I can always wash it off in the water, just like that one person told me. Duh. All right, dude. So I'll totally, I'll totally mate here. And hopefully I can find a prime mate. I will... I'm willing to even check both the mates out here. In hopes... Oh. Man, I don't want to mess with zebra or an ostrich because both of those things can actually kick the lion cub's ass. Because I have messed with zebras and ostriches before as a small animal. And even though I am a predator, they are a much bigger grazer than I am a predator. So... Oh, is that a lion over there? That sure would be nice. Oh! <gasps> My own kind! They don't want to kill me. That That's actually very fortunate that there's, um... A lion pack out here. That's actually extremely fortunate. Although it is extremely unfortunate right now that the toxicity is going- <gasps> But I've got primo pet food! 
I don't want to waste that right now, though. Let's go with three ounce bottled water. That will reduce my toxicity. Dude, this is such an unfortunate time for the toxicity to be going up. Oh, oh no. I'm not, I'm not fucking with that right now. I should, like, lure that into those... Oh, more, more croc. It'd be fortunate if I could, like, lure the crocodile into those adult lions and just kind of, like, get my problems to cancel each other out. Because the... Well, technically, the adult lions aren't even a problem for me. Oh. Oh, no. Those bunnies saw me from, like, a billion miles away. Sorry, bunny. Your death will bring upon my strength. And I'm gonna need a lot of strength to defeat dinosaurs. Oh, my... This bunny is gonna die. Stupid bunny. She can't even live against me. Oh, I, and actually, I need the clean kills, too. Clean kills will get me more challenges right now. And more challenge... And more challenge victories will result in better stats for my next generation. For my start. And then... Oh, you know what? This is, this is gonna work out. Oh, crap. This bunny saw me. Sorry, bunny. It's like when you see me murder somebody, I have to kill you, you know? That's just the way it goes. Alright, here we go. Now let's cross our fingers. Let's cross those paws, <laughs> because of a lion cub, for some prime mates. And I gotta remember that- oh, oh no! Oh no! That Lycan saw me. And now it's dead. Once again, if you see me, you have to die. It's just like spy games. Playing the spy games. Oh! Oh, it's a horse. Luckily, horses don't have a taste. Look at all these all these animals that aren't even gonna fuck with me. I just have to accidentally not hit them, because the horse will fucking stomp my shit until I'm dead as fuck. So, we do not want to mess with the horse. Dude, horses and giraffes, the wildlife out here is just... So friendly and great. I love it. I love it so much. But I do really need to go sleep. And at least it'll be daytime when I... When I wake from my eternal slumber. And I wake up as the king of the jungle. Like right now, I'm just the son of the king of the jungle. But when I wake from my slumber, I will be the king of the jungle. And I've been like leaning ever closer to my mic as I've been going, I just realized. So hopefully I can fix that in editing. I'm sure it won't- I'm sure it won't be a problem. I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, and guess what? Guess what now? Oh, I was like, guess what now, but... That lion... Or that ostrich knows the deal. Now, zebras don't stand no chance against me. Can't stop me when I'm not a cub, can you, bitch? Technically, I don't really need to be worrying about these... About food too much right now. What I really need to be worrying about is... If this is a prime mate or not. It is! Oh my gosh, dude, my strategy of going through the sewers as a lion cub, like, worked out perfectly. Seriously. And so here's what I'll do. Now, I'll go through the other half of Yoyogi Park, and I will mark all the spots in the other half of Yoyogi Park, and then, um, I can sleep again, Become a fully grown lion, and then I'll be ready. I think I'll be ready for the dinosaurs. I don't know. I'm still a little bit worried. Like, after the last episode where I, where I had to unlock something by... I guess that was just by marking all the territory. After the last episode, though, um, I'm pretty worried about these predator encounters right now. Like, they're seeming pretty damn tough at the moment. But I don't know. You know what? King of the Jungle versus the King of the Cretaceous Period. I actually don't know. I'm just, like, making stuff up. I'm pulling stuff out of my ass. I don't know what period the Dionychus... I can't remember it without looking at the name. I can't remember what the Dionychus... I can't... The, the Dionychus, that's it. I can't remember what period the Dionychus is from. I'm not... I haven't studied that kind of stuff in school in many, many years. Oh, and now we get to see all the challenges I failed. Definitely I failed eating 4,500 calories, I think. Did I? Oh, wow. I didn't complete a single challenge. That is awful. Oh, and I'm taking... Oh, get out of the way. Get out of the way. He's going to do his charge. Look at that. I got all my little wolves out of the way. 
he wasn't able to Oh, he's got a charge off! That was bullshit! Well, he's gonna die. That boar is gonna die to pay for his sin of charging at my poor little defenseless lion cubs. I guess they're not defenseless. I mean, they did just... Oh, don't... Oh, I almost ate that. I was like, I'm already at full health. There's no reason to eat poisoned meat when my toxicity is already slowly creeping up the meter. All right. So now hopefully the strategy continues to work as long as there's not any, like, major enemies in this area that can kick the shit out of me. But... All right. Defeat 30 animals again, which I will probably... To be 100% honest, I wouldn't be surprised if I complete that challenge just by doing the dinosaur challenge, because usually the dinosaurs are, like, surrounded by... Or, I mean, usually the bosses are, like, just surrounded by other things that you have to kill. The other problem with waiting as long as I have now is that the dinosaurs, I feel like, are going to be very strong. Alright, non-poison water. I, even though I was hoping that there wouldn't be too many animals that would kick my ass here, I am hoping there would be some animals whose asses I can kick because... I do need to keep that toxicity meter down. I don't want to start dying of toxicity before I go to challenge the the dinosaurs. Whatever. I might have to end up... I'm not going to take any of the medicine. Saving the medicine... There we go. 16 ounce water completely lowers my toxicity. That's awesome. I was like, I'm saving the medicine for when those, um, dinosaurs kick my ass. Alright, are you ready for this? I've been, like, building up to this for a long time now. I've got... Here we go. Check it. I've got a fully grown pack of lions. This female should come with me. Even though she just randomly spawned there, she should totally, like, join my pack. But she's not gonna. Alright. Alright. I'm not gonna go take a mate because I don't I, I want these fully grown lions now. We're gonna sneak is this the area? Yep, this is the area, alright. We're gonna be sneaky because I wanna take them out slowly but surely. Although this hippo's gonna ruin everything. See! The hippo ruined everything! Huh! I knew! I knew I was gonna go for that hippo! Oh, except for the boss spawned right here! I may just be a lucky boy! Oh, I missed my chance while it was stunned. Oh my gosh. Dinosaur. Oh, did you see that? Did you see that? I built that up so much. I seriously, I built that up. So much. And now here I am, feasting on Hippo. And feasting on Dinonychuses. I'm gonna go, dude. I'm gonna go take this territory now. And kill this hippo. Oh, the, the hippos are tricking me again! See that? The, the hippos are, like, tricking me into not noticing the fact that there's a Dinonychus right here. Oh my gosh. That was so cool that I got that challenge done. And now I can finally play as a dinosaur. And look at these. Dinosaurs are beasts. Like, these are, like, I don't I guess they're a type of raptor. And they're probably, like, I'm sure that the guys who made this game, like, probably... Oh, dude, they're, like, afraid of me. Oh, no, no, they're just... They're just worried about something else, apparently. What are they worried about? What the fuck? Dude, these Dinonychuses don't even want to have anything to do with me. Probably because... Dude, if a full... Okay, I'm gonna be honest. If I were... If I were a lion, or if I were a dinosaur, and just like a full pack of lions... Oh, he's... He saw me. And like a full pack of lions came my way, I would probably be afraid of them regardless of the fact that I was a dinosaur. Like, seriously. How could you- Oh, that hippo is definitely running from a dinosaur. Where's the dinosaur that it's running from? Oh, dude, all these hippos are like... Hippos. In case you thought hippos were not afraid of dinosaurs, the answer is... This game answers the great questions of history that you've always wanted to answer. Hippos are, in fact, afraid of Dinonychuses. Which... This area now seems to be very lacking in Dinonychuses, and of course I'm gonna like, right the second I like waste all my stamina, I'm gonna get like sprung by 20 of them. I don't know, it just didn't seem like a challenge. That's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna take this territory now. I actually feel- and look! I've got some lion backup. Alright, so... 
I feel we're probably around the 30 minute point in my recording anyways. I have unlocked the Dynanicus. So I think this is a good place to end this recording right here. This has been Rakdar. Thank you for watching.